The war in Ukraine has gripped the world's attention. It's a conflict with global implications. Russia's invasion launched in February 2022 has shattered the peace in Europe. The conflict has displaced millions and resulted in countless casualties. The world watches as two nations grapple with the devastating consequences of war. At the heart of the conflict is Ukraine, a nation fighting for its survival. Russia, a global power, seeks to assert its dominance and reshape the geopolitical landscape. The conflict has drawn in global actors with the USA and NATO providing crucial support to Ukraine. The war has also exposed the deep divisions within the international community. The conflict has raised profound questions about the future of Europe and the rules-based international order. The world anxiously awaits a resolution, uncertain of the path to peace. The conflict has also underscored the devastating human cost of war. Millions have been displaced from their homes, seeking refuge in neighboring countries. The war has left an indelible mark on the lives of countless individuals, families, and communities. The United States and its NATO allies have stood firmly with Ukraine. They condemn Russia's aggression as a violation of international law. The West has imposed severe sanctions on Russia, targeting its economy and key individuals. Military aid has flowed into Ukraine, bolstering its defenses against the Russian onslaught. The West's response has been swift and resolute, demonstrating its commitment to Ukraine's sovereignty and territorial integrity. The conflict has reinvigorated NATO, reaffirming its role as a bulwark against aggression. The West's actions reflect a determination to uphold the principles of democracy and self-determination. However, the conflict has also exposed the challenges of maintaining a united front. Differences have emerged within NATO regarding the level of military support for Ukraine. Some members are wary of escalating the conflict fearing a wider war with Russia. Despite these challenges, the West remains committed to supporting Ukraine's right to self-defense. The conflict has underscored the importance of transatlantic unity in the face of shared threats. The West's resolve will continue to shape the trajectory of the conflict. Russia views the conflict through a different lens. It justifies its actions as a necessary response to NATO expansion and Western influence in its sphere of interest. Moscow claims that Ukraine's government is illegitimate and that it is protecting Russian-speaking populations in the East. The Kremlin's narrative has been widely disputed by the international community, however it is crucial to understand Russia's perspective to navigate the complexities of the conflict. Russia's actions are driven by a complex interplay of historical grievances, geopolitical ambitions, and domestic political calculations. Putin has framed the conflict as a struggle against the West, seeking to rally support at home. He has accused the West of hypocrisy, pointing to its history of military interventions. Russia's perspective highlights the deep mistrust that exists between the two sides. The conflict has also exacerbated Russia's isolation on the world stage. The West's sanctions have crippled its economy and its international reputation has been tarnished. Russia's actions have alienated former partners and strengthened its ties with countries like China and Iran. Kirilo Budanov, head of Ukraine's main directorate of intelligence, offers a sobering assessment of the conflict. He predicts that Russia aims to secure a victory by 2026. Budanov believes that Russia is facing mounting internal pressures but remains determined to achieve its objectives in Ukraine. Budinov's assessment highlights the challenges of predicting the conflict's trajectory. The situation on the ground is fluid, and the effectiveness of sanctions remains uncertain. Russia's willingness to sustain a prolonged conflict should not be underestimated. Budinov's predictions underscore the need for continued international support for Ukraine. A negotiated settlement remains elusive, and the conflict could drag on for years. The international community must be prepared for a long and difficult road ahead. The conflict has also exposed the limitations of intelligence assessments. The fog of war makes it difficult to predict the enemy's intentions and capabilities with certainty. Budanov's predictions serve as a reminder of the uncertainties inherent in warfare. Section 5. The Year 2025. Budanov identifies 2025 as a pivotal year for Russia. He believes that the country will face a confluence of challenges, including economic hardship, social unrest, and political instability. These challenges could undermine Russia's ability to sustain its military campaign in Ukraine. The impact of Western sanctions is expected to intensify in the coming years. Russia's economy is already reeling from the effects of sanctions, 
and its long-term growth prospects are bleak. The Kremlin's ability to mitigate the economic fallout will be crucial to its war effort. Social unrest is another potential challenge for the Kremlin. The war has already exacted a heavy toll on the Russian people, both in terms of casualties and economic hardship. The Kremlin's ability to maintain social stability will be tested as the conflict drags on. Political instability is another risk factor for Russia. The war has exposed divisions within the Russian elite, and Putin's grip on power may weaken if the conflict continues to go badly. The possibility of a power struggle in Moscow cannot be ruled out. Section 6. The Korean Factor. The war in Ukraine has also drawn in actors far beyond Europe. North Korea, a longtime ally of Russia, has emerged as a key supplier of weapons and ammunition. This alliance has raised concerns about the proliferation of weapons and the potential for further escalation. North Korea's involvement in the conflict highlights the complex geopolitical dynamics at play. Pyongyang sees an opportunity to advance its own interests by supporting Russia's war effort. The alliance also underscores the challenges of containing the conflict. The flow of weapons from North Korea to Russia has intensified the fighting in Ukraine. North Korean artillery shells in particular have bolstered Russia's firepower. The international community has condemned North Korea's actions, but efforts to stem the flow of weapons have been largely ineffective. North Korea's involvement in the conflict has also raised concerns about the potential for further escalation. Some analysts fear that North Korea could provide Russia with more sophisticated weapons, such as ballistic missiles. Such a development would have profound implications for regional security. Section 7, Zelensky's Plea. Amidst the devastation and uncertainty Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky has remained a beacon of hope. He has rallied his people and galvanized international support for Ukraine's cause. Zelensky has repeatedly called for peace but has also vowed to fight on until victory is achieved. Zelensky's leadership has been instrumental in bolstering Ukrainian morale. His defiance in the face of Russian aggression has made him a global icon. Zelensky's speeches have resonated with audiences worldwide, reminding the world of the human cost of the conflict. Zelensky has also played a key role in securing international support for Ukraine. His diplomatic efforts have been crucial in rallying Western allies and securing vital military aid. Zelensky's leadership has been essential to Ukraine's resilience in the face of Russian aggression. Zelensky's stance reflects the delicate balance Ukraine must strike between pursuing peace and defending its national interests. He has repeatedly called for negotiations with Russia, emphasizing the need for dialogue and diplomacy to end the bloodshed. Section 8 Putin's Demands Russian President Vladimir Putin has also spoken of peace, but his conditions for ending the conflict remain unacceptable to Ukraine and its allies. Putin demands recognition of Russia's annexation of Crimea and the independence of the Donbas region. These demands are non-starters for Ukraine and the international community, as they would reward Russia's aggression and violate Ukraine's sovereignty. Putin's stance reflects his belief that Russia is engaged in an existential struggle with the West. He sees the conflict in Ukraine as part of a broader contest for influence and security. Putin's demands highlight the significant challenges in finding a peaceful resolution to the conflict. The impasse in negotiations underscores the deep mistrust and divergent objectives that continue to fuel the conflict. Putin's demands have been met with defiance from Ukraine and its allies, who have vowed to continue supporting Ukraine's right to self-defense. The conflicting positions of Putin and Zelensky underscore the deep mistrust and divergent objectives that continue to fuel the conflict. It remains uncertain whether a diplomatic solution can bridge the gap between the two sides and achieve a lasting peace. The path to peace remains elusive. Section 9. The Economic Battlefield. The war in Ukraine is not just being fought on the battlefields, it is also being waged on the economic front. The West has imposed unprecedented sanctions on Russia. Russia has weaponized its energy exports. The economic war is impacting both sides. Russia's economy is contracting. The West faces rising energy prices and inflation. The economic battlefield is crucial as the conflict continues. Section 10. The Specter of Unrest. As the war in Ukraine grinds on, both Russia and Ukraine face growing social unrest. Economic hardship and mounting casualties fuel discontent in Russia. In Ukraine, devastation and displacement test the people's resilience. 
The Kremlin faces growing public anger and responds with repression. Protests are met with a harsh crackdown and the media is muzzled. Section 11, A Fragile Hope. The war in Ukraine is a tragedy for all involved. Yet, even amid the darkness, there is a glimmer of hope. The international community has shown remarkable unity. Countries around the world have provided support to Ukraine. The Ukrainian people have shown extraordinary courage and resilience. The resilience of the Ukrainian people is a testament to the human spirit.